Alright, on see I'm a one and a quarter miles from Lewitt Falls. And look at this big ravine I'm crossing here. Goes all the way to Spirit Lake. This is the south end of Spirit Lake. And this leads straight up to where well, the clouds are kind of spoiling it right now. But that right there is uh, Mount St. Helens. Let's get on crossing this right here. All right, we're going to get a good nature video here. I don't think I'll do too much ranting, really, or rambling. All right, done my rambling. I'm going to just kind of chill. Enjoy nature. When somebody wants something to talk about or ask me about something, they can put it in the comments. And I can do it in a future video. Wow, look at that. Mount St. Helens, Washington. This is the beginnings of some river. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, let's see which way I'm going. This is all from the eruption 44 years ago. There's a little island over there. I remember seeing that. And I guess that big waterfall is Lewitt Falls. That I saw that's like 500 feet tall at least. We shall see. That all this. 44 years. This is the growth vegetation here. See, and of course, this all gets washed out. Ugh. That's why this ravine's so deep. I'm only getting deeper. Yeah, I'm glad I chose this one. This is my third time trying to do this one. So, third time lucky. First time, it was late June. Last week of June, I believe. And it was still closed. And then I came back what, a week or two ago. And then Truman Trust closed because of all the construction going on for this inlet Spirit Lake. At least that's what they're saying. Uh, forgive me if I don't believe what they're saying. Oh, wow. Look at the... Wow. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> wow, look at that. Wow. There we go. Now, I was on the opposite end of Spirit Lake. On the north end there. At Harmony Falls Trail. That's a nice trail. I highly recommend it. I was over, not on that side, but here on the right, coming up around this bend here. That's where most of the logs are at. And then I was there. And then, of course, I did No Way Pass up on the top there. But, yeah. I saw them, them elk. Heard an elk come through here earlier. But, yeah, look at this. I mean, oh, and there's even the... Look up there. You can even see... About a half moon. Yeah. Like I said, it's a beautiful day. I'll take it. The next two, it was for the next three Sundays. I'm gonna do this one. I'm glad this glad this one. I'm glad I'm doing this one today because Paradise Skyline Loop. I'm sure it's uh, cloudy and windy and rainy. Same goes for uh, Sunrise at uh, Burrow Mountain. Uh, I'm going to do first, second, third Burrow Mountain there. Uh, see, those are the next two weekend or next two Sundays. So I was hoping that it was going to be clear here. And it is. 
not perfectly clear, which is okay. Hey, I saw a great view earlier. So look at all that. There's that construction there that they're working at, as you can see. It goes around. It's on the south side of the Spirit Lake here. Which is beautiful. Even over there, it's got some great views. Yeah. Anyway, I got a lot on my plate coming up. Oh, I'm going to... I didn't go to the Washington State Fair last year, and I regret that. And I won't make that mistake this year, because I'll be going twice at least. Probably more than that. But uh, twice at least to see uh, Steve Miller Band in Alabama. So I'm looking forward to that. That's uh, Alabama is September 18th, and Steve Miller Band is uh, September 22nd to close out the fair. So I'm going to get some people watching video and stuff. Asked to come. And then the next month, beginning of October, I fly back home. Go to Marquee Biscuit Blues Festival. Hadn't been uh, in a couple years. And uh, looking forward to just going up there and jamming on some music. So yeah. You can get to see family. I'm going to stay, go to Eureka Springs and stay at the Big Cat Sanctuary there. Turpentine Creek. Stay the night there in their tree house. So looking forward to that and going to Fayetteville, seeing family. So seeing friends and having a good time for those 16 days or so I'm back home. I got lots of stuff planned up here. Be going to Leavenworth later, going back down to Southwest Washington, staying in the Orange uh, uh, Long Beach area. Uh, going to eat some oysters in Oysterville. Of course, you can imagine what I did in Tokeland. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, you want to get me a video eating oysters in Oysterville? You darn tootin'. Oh, man, this is awesome. I literally have this entire trail to myself. Sunday, August 25th. It's my one-year anniversary up in the Pacific Northwest. I got here exactly. You know, in the afternoon, I was still on the road. I came up here for a travel assignment to work. Three months turned into, well, you know, one year. And I'm not traveling anymore after 20 plus years. And I'm not regretting it one bit. It's been a pretty, uh, pretty fun, uh, year, past year here. And, uh, nothing stopping that. Life's what you make of it, people. There's something you don't like about your life, change it. People you don't like in your life, dump them. Do it. Once you start doing that, you're going to realize, whoa, what took me so long? Oh, look at that view. Awesome. Yeah, you learn to say no, it, it's contagious. I'm telling you. I got no problem telling people no now. I used to hate telling people no. They don't want to hurt people's feelings. They don't want to let people down. People will only take advantage of you as long as you allow them to. That's just the honest truth, people. Nobody takes advantage of me anymore. Oh, I am the master of my domain. Is that bamboo? That looks like bamboo almost. No, nah, that's not. That's just bushes, I bet. Oh, man. Yeah, here we go. Now you see where the logs are on the north end of uh, Spirit Lake. Oh man, look at this. Beautiful. I love the fact I'm uh, crossing these glacial melts. I'm letting cross them now when the water's low. Not when it's a torrent. There's another one getting ready to cross here. Oh, look at that up there. Wow. It's one of my uh, earlier domes that are blocking my view now. That's all right. Heck, I feel good enough. I might. Oh, wow. Look how steep this bad boy is. And there's some moisture we've got in here, too. I got to make sure I don't slip on the, all the holes there. I guess people are using poles. I got no poles. I don't care to use any poles. I don't do that kind of hiking. 
And today, I'm not knocking anybody though. If you use poles, don't be, oh, how dare you? Each their own. I don't need it. One of these days, I guess, I might need it. But not right now. You know, but hey, do what you have. You do you. I'm not knocking you, I promise. Came across like that. And dee, dee. Whoa! <laughs> there we go. Uh-huh. Keep your head on the swivel, people. Oh, man, look at that. Oh, look, it's like a little hummock here. Boy, but there's some wildlife in that vegetation. Ferns, I bet it's just real lush in there. If you get a chance to, on the south side of uh, Mount St. Helens here, do hummocks trail. Oh, man, if it's clear, you will not regret it, I promise. Dang, look at that. Oh, that is awesome. Let me get this over here, too. All right. So look at that. Oh, man, it's so cool. All right, I gotta get my glasses off. Sweating too much. Ugh. There we go. Oh, finna. Welcome to the jungle. We got fun and games. Hey, let's go through, run through the jungle. <laughs> ah. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh. Oh, man, hang on. Uh, bollocks get out of my way woohoo I probably should have put my glasses on but oh well oh ho, 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 ho. yeah I know how I'm crossing this bitch boop, 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 boop. Ha, 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 ha. Ha, 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 oh nice look at that Beautiful. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at that. Pretty cool. Uh, get out of my way. Oh, steep. Oh, wrong way. Oh. Whoopsie. There we go. Man, you see? Man. Oh, yep, yeah, we're finna open up. Get a great view of uh, Spirit Lake to the north. I'm hoping the clouds will burn off here. I can get a view of uh, Mount Rainier in the background. But if not, hey, two out of three ain't bad. I've already seen uh, Mount St. Helens and I hope to see more of her. But we shall see. See, I just crossed that, as y'all can see. I uh, guarantee. Oh, look at the dust blowing up over there. That dust blowing up over there. Or now it might be the reflection there. I thought that was dust blowing. I ain't got my glasses on. Y'all leave me alone. <sighs> wow. See, 44 years ago, this was nothing. Rocks and ash, sterile, nothing was alive. And not even bacteria. I remember this happening 44 years ago, 1980. I was seven years old and here I am now. I ain't gonna hike up to the top of her. I don't do no summit, I ain't a spelunker or a mountaineer. I just hike around mountains, I just hike. Waterfalls, views, just whatever. Oh man, look at that. All right, let's get up there. Let's 
And yeah, people, quit watching the news. I'll tell you right now, that main, that fake news, it's called fake news for a reason. Stuff's nothing but lies and propaganda. The media, celebrities, everybody's for one party. Yeah. That tells you all you need to know right there. You got a bunch of rich, out of touch people. Whether they be, you know, how many of these crooked politicians have got, how many millions upon millions of dollars they've enriched themselves? I'm looking at you, Obamas, Pelosi. Y'all ain't the only ones. It goes on both sides of the aisle. But man, you damn Democrats, man. Y'all are something else. You know, you got to open your eyes, people. Think for yourselves. Be free thinkers. Be free folk. I am glad to say that I'm free folk. I don't think y'all realize what that fucking means or what that entails, but I can promise you it means exactly what it is. I am free. I answer to no one. Nobody tells me what to do. Nobody pulls any strings on me. I do everything of my own free will. Within reason. You know, moderation now. I don't go around lying, stealing, cheating, robbing, thugging. I've done stuff in my past I ain't proud of when I was young. No excuse. You know, all you can do is, uh, you know, try to live my life best possible for the present and for the future. Learn from the past, but I'm not stuck in the past. I don't dwell on the past. I'm all about the present and looking towards the future. My future. I don't give two shits about anybody else's future. Nobody's out there looking for my best interest but me. So, that's right. I'm going to go out there and take what's rightfully mine. And I'm going to earn it like I have. I don't want nothing handed or given to me. I wouldn't want it anyway. I couldn't wake. I couldn't go to bed at night. Wake up in the morning, look myself in the mirror. You know, people. Every decision you make, whether small or big, it has consequences. Whether they're good consequences or bad consequences, you just keep making bad choice after bad choice after bad choice. I mean, bad things are going to happen. What'd you expect? You think there's shortcuts. There are some shortcuts in life, but there's shortcuts that you gain. You know, like I have, for instance, my credit score. I have, my credit score is, what, 830, I guess? So it's been over 800 for years because I pay all my bills. Always have, always will. Make sure of it. Well, I said I wasn't going to ramble, and I guess I am. Well, anyway, I mean, seriously, people. You know, I can get along. Pretty much for, I guess, a couple hundred thousand dollars anytime I want. Because I can, it don't mean I should. <sighs> Hell, I plan on getting me a new vehicle. I, I'm 51 years old. I can count on my hand, one hand, the number of vehicles I've had in my life. And the first three were POSs. Straight up, four POSs. And uh last two have lasted at least, you know, I've had two vehicles since 2001. So there you go. Oh. oh, excuse me. At least getting out here, get my sinuses cleared out. So that's good. Going under weather last week. So I didn't get to do a sunrise at Mount Rainier, but I will. Oh man, look at this. Nice. She's starting to get the clouds out of the way there. That's good. And look at Spirit Lake. Anyway, um, you know, my credit, you know, you pay your bills, man. Uh, all this crap. I got six credit cards and I pay them off. I only use two of them and for rewards. But I pay them off every month. I don't keep any balance. I have not paid interest in at least 10 years. And that is no lie. That is the truth. Oh, wow. Look at this here.
That's freaking awesome, man. All right, now, I'm assuming I cross here. Yeah, I guess I do. I see the trail, so I guess I got to get down there and get over it. Ugh. It's like the third or fourth ravine I've crossed here now. Of course, don't, don't be fooled. This might look dry. It's underground going, I promise you. I don't see no gold here. This is it. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Wow. Yeah. But yeah, I plan on at least another year, year and a half, get me a new vehicle and get, I'm not going to finance. I'm going to pay cash, buy it a year old. It's less than 20,000 miles or around 20,000 miles on it. Get extended warranty. They got a deal on it. I'm going to pay cash. I'm not taking a note. And then when I build a house in 14 years, give or take, paying cash for it, no note. Well, it's easy when you ain't got no bills. And I ain't going to pay no bills. I won't need to. I don't need to establish credit. I have credit established. All I do now is maintain. And I help my son out too. I put his name on one of my credit cards. Hell, he was 16, I guess. He's 21 now. Uh, and, uh, excuse me, 22. Yeah, and he, uh, I was gonna co-sign for him if I had to on a new vehicle last year he bought his credit was so good he didn't even need a co-signer me or his mama 21 years old and was able to buy a brand new vehicle on his own accord you see that's the fruits of my labor you dang right i'm gonna take advantage of that and pass that on to my son heck yeah let him get a low interest rate because his credit's so good all right now, which way do I go now? Jeez, do I cross over? Let me check this out. Ah, yeah, I finally found a way to cross. I just kept had to go up a little further there, cross those boulders there, and then my lie. Straight on over here. Look at this here, some pretty cool little pools. And make sure these rocks ain't too slick. And make it this far just to fall down and go boo boom and you get boo boos no Ugh. wow let me get around this boulder here Ooh. wow uh. <laughs> yeah look at that I have this whole place to myself. There might be a person around here or there, but you know what? They ain't nowhere near me. And that is fine by me. Enjoy the little bonuses in life that life gives you. <clears throat> but what if you fall and get hurt? Well, if I fall and get hurt, then I deserve it. Jesus Christ. I don't know what about people. Oh, if I got back on the trail. <laughs> there we go. Wow, look at all these boulders. <laughs> that line the edge of this ravine. All right. Well, I shouldn't be too much further from... Leewood Falls. Man, look at Spirit Lake. Wow, look at them logs, too. I know I was at the top of that literally two weeks ago. Show sure enough. I 
Oh, anyway, yeah, about, uh, like, you know, taking care of your finances, man. Yeah, you pay your bills, you should be rewarded. There's nothing wrong with that. I pay my bills. So, yeah, I have a good credit. I use the system to my advantage. You know, no wrong getting, what, about $1,000 every 15 months or so for free. You know, heck, that's, uh, that's just being smart. So, yeah, but I had to be disciplined enough to pay it off every month. So I do. Like I said, I, my total monthly expenses, all my utilities combined, don't cost a thousand dollars. So I'm able to put back a lot of money. But I also get to play and enjoy myself within, you know, reason, moderation, folks. That's what people don't. I always want to keep over to Joneses. You're all up on fake book, as I call it. And the twatters and the snappy chats or what the hell ever. People are always up there lying. And, oh, look at my life and how awesome it is. Influencers. Anybody that's influenced by an influencer deserves the ridicule they get. As far as I'm concerned, an influencer is subhuman. Get a real job, people. You people have zero impact on my life. Oh, man, I, I'm looking forward to the day some influencer tries to throw some clout around me. I'm going to show them with five fingers set at a face. That's all the clout I need. Oh, man, this is so cool. But, yeah, be sure to get out there and enjoy yourselves, people. Wow, man, look how quiet it is. To the east, to the north, to the west. Yeah. But yeah, keep your finances in order. Hell, I started off 18 years old with a bankruptcy. Because I had a motorcycle wreck. I didn't have medical insurance. So I was pretty much all medical bills. Hey, man. You gotta crawl before you walk. Progress, not perfection. So it took a long time to get to where I'm at. You know, but I mean, hey. You do the best of what life gives you. I had to do it. I wasn't proud of it. I had 18 years old, no assets. Sixty, seventy thousand dollars in debt. You know, but I promise you, I won't ever have to file again. I promise you that. And that's because I don't ever put myself in a situation. I have a rainy day fund. And I don't put all my eggs in one basket. I diversify. You know, short, mid, long term goals. I'm no financial genius by any means. I, I'll be the first to admit that. Heck, I played the stock market once, and I did my due diligence. Shoot, for six whole months, I looked at stocks, and then I narrowed down on one, and as soon as I bought it, it I bought it for $5.35. It never saw $5.35. No, excuse me, $5.25. Two years later, I sold it for $0.35. Cents. <laughs> Took a huge loss and i learned my lesson then i said uh-huh it tells me all i need to know wow look at that over to the east and look how this opens up to the west keep going that way i know that'll take you to spirit lake uh highway and uh johnson ridge and hummox over that way so the hummox trail and that right there, I would definitely be doing again. I've done that twice now. I'm probably going to make an annual ritual with that. Come down here and do the ice cave and maybe June Lake. There's all kinds of stuff to do down here. I think I still got to do Columbia River Gorge. I'm going to like go down. Oh, like I was saying earlier, um, down the oyster. We're going to do Southwest Washington, then Northwest Oregon, including uh, Astoria. I want to, because I'm Gen X, I'm going to try to see any uh, Goonie stuff. Hey, you guys. Stop love chunk. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna check that out. Um, what else coming up here? I'm gonna see Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice here in a couple weeks. Probably Labor Day. 
I'm probably going to watch that Labor Day. So, yeah, I'll, I'm a big fan of the first one. I watched, actually, the first one a couple of weeks ago. I got it on Voodoo. Another thing, yeah, or Fandango is what they call it now. I have literally thousands of movies, about 2,000 movies on my Fandango, and at least a, probably a couple hundred shows, you know, either a seasons or a full series that I've bought, accumulated over the years. Because TV just sucks now, man. Hollywood sucks. They can be Holly weird all they want now. I don't want anything to do with them. Unless there's a video here and there, or a movie that comes out here and there, that I want to see. A handful a year that I choose to do. Man, I got no problem at all just watching older stuff. Because it's good quality. And, uh, you know, I can watch it uh, without any commercials. I'm so sick and tired of commercials. Oh. like YouTube. I ain't making any money off YouTube and I probably won't ever because I ain't gonna kiss their ass. I won't ever bend their knee, suck their woke peckers. Now, I treat YouTube for what they actually are. They're nothing more than a web host, a video hosting site to me. That's it. Oh, almost there. All right. Quarter mile left. Oh man, look at that. Oh, Spirit Lake. Hey, uh, hey, uh. Get a good reflection view now. Oh wow, look at the red up there. What is that? Wow. All right. Anyway, well, that's enough for this video. I'm going to get on over here, get ready to do some video for uh, Lewitt Falls here, and then uh, see what else. Anyway, well, I guess I did ramble a little bit. Hopefully, it was a good ramble. If not, sorry, fuck off. Um, you know, find, find a joy in your life. You know, I ain't changing for you, and you ain't got to change for me. I don't want nobody changing for me. You want to change, you want to change for yourself. You know, I believe I'm a big proponent of free will. It's not my job to make you or show you how to live your best life possible. I can give you some advice, friendly advice here. It don't cost anything. So you can take with it what you want. You know, it's not one size fits all for everybody. But it's a blueprint. You can take and pick and choose what you want from it. I promise you it works. I'm living proof of it. Trust me, nobody was more of a screw up than I was growing up. But you know what? I finally decided to take control of my destiny. Do away with tomfoolery. I realize what's coming. The wars that are to come. And I'm ready for them. So, until they come, I'm going to live my best life possible. So, anyway, oh man, it's so cool. Y'all get out there and enjoy nature, people. Later.